on this RV decor morph, we are going into Ikea and see what they have, what I think would work in your camper. We are here in downtown Atlanta, me and Angie, she works with me. See what they have. I've never been and I'm in for a treat is what Angie says. Good enough for my car and I fit my car in there. Yeah, you're, <laughs> Angie's way aggressive driving. I am from the slow little country town. We don't have much traffic in this Atlanta stuff. Oh, so if you come to Atlanta, Ikea, traffic, prepare. They, um, I just saw that it said oversized parking, so you might get to park in your RV here. That's, I don't know how oversized oversized is. <laughs> Probably is. There was already a line, people lined up outside. Sure. We're getting here when it opens. <laughs> it's gonna be like, a, I got a film crew today. <laughs> Angie's gonna be my film crew. Oh my gosh, it's got escalators. Oh yeah. Where are we going? Let me know in the comments if you've ever been to Ikea before, because uh, this is my first time ever. And I know that's probably kind of crazy. I can already tell you, organization-wise, we're gonna have fun. <laughs> Do we have a buggy? We need a buggy. We already need a buggy and we can't even be here a few minutes, but we gotta go back down. <laughs> you think that we have buggies upstairs. Oh no, but can you imagine hanging that up in the camper, up in the ceiling in the kit in the bathtub? Oh, I love that. That would be awesome. You could hang towel, like dry towels. Yeah, and, and like this would be like super cool. It's uh, $4.99 or $6.99? Oh, $6.99. That says $4.99. Mm -hmm. It's just a price must have just changed. Yeah. But still, at $6.99, these would be great because you can hang it inside the camper or you can hang it outside if you're at the beach. I'm getting one of these for myself. Put it in. Oh, these parts are awesome. Oh, look at that. It's a <laughs> sidewinder. A lot of people use IKEA sofas in their camper just because typically they're a lot smaller scale. And I can see why I see a lot of them. When we have to replace our couch, I am for sure coming here for the camper. Lots of options. If you wanted to put your plates in a drawer, you put this and these pegs. Oh, they didn't. They probably twist. They yeah. move, and then you can make it to where your big plates and your bowls, and you stack them. So when you go pull them out of your drawer, you can just pull them whatever. Yeah, that would keep them from rolling around in your RV while you're uh, traveling. You're videoing me. I. <laughs> They're nice. I don't see a price. A lot of it does. Oh, oh, okay, over there. If you're trying to supply your RV kitchen, they have all kinds of different organizing things. Gosh, I wish I had I wish I had one of these closer and was able to do this. I think like these here would be great, like to hang in the bathroom or in the bedroom for additional storage. Because you have all different options that you could put on these. Oh, look. I just did a Dollar Tree when I got a dollar ninety-nine, but this is my color of my camper. <laughs> I can't. I can't. Oh, I want to. Okay. They have these muck shoe racks. I think when you're camping, if you keep your shoes outside, this would be great to put outside. I know a lot of people don't take their shoes inside. We have the new shoe rack, but I like this. That way you could keep muddy shoes and stuff out of your camper. 
Yeah. I'm getting one of these for the house because I already have a collapsible one in the camper. But this collapsible colander for $4.99, I like it. For $9.99, they have these collapsible laundry bins. I think that would be great for the camper. They have this collapsible laundry basket as well, and it's $10.49. If you needed an ironing board for the camper, this is $7.49. And uh, it's just a little flat one that would fit up under the bed. I'm wanting to get some of these to go under our bed in the house, not the camper. But these would be great to go up under the bed in the camper because they zip and they have hard sides and you could keep your stuff separated under the camper bed as well. They have these really cool felt boxes. There are three of them for $5.49. I think these would be perfect for the camper because you can put what you need in them and then squish them down to whatever size you need it to be. I like those. Those would be even great in your drawers. I also found these really cool jute baskets. They're $14.99 and they're collapsible as well, but they're pretty big. And then I think that they could get into a lot of the overhead spaces. I like those. They have these cute, like, battery-operated lights that would sit out, like, outside your campsite. I think they would be kind of cute. That's $4.99, and then they have this little red one for $5.99. I think if you have, like, a permanent spot that your camper stays at, and I'm thinking about this for next year at our hunting club, because outside our campsite, it kind of can get dirty and muddy, but they have these snap-together towels. They come in a wood, a grass, and then they have a black and a tan, and they can just snap together and go on an area and fill it in real quick. I probably wouldn't go with the wood though, if you're traveling with them, because they're kind of heavy. That's mine and hers. Spending a few things. I think what is amazing about this place is if you had a specific space that you needed to organize, I would so measure that space and then come here and look for items to fill it because they have so many options and the prices are really great. <laughs> We're about to check out, but I do have some spaces in my RV that I do want to measure and make Bill come back over here one day when I have all those correct sizes so I can organize it better. If you know where there's an Ikea or you have one close, I would definitely recommend to go try it out and get stuff for your camper. Till next time, like and subscribe.